Good morning, Northwest. I'm Marilyn. And I'm Aiden. And, and we'd, we'd like to welcome you to Titan Connect. Please stand for the pledge. Put your right hand over your heart and your left hand by your side and say it with me. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the dress code check. You may now be seated. Strength and Conditioning Club. The Strength and Conditioning Club with Miss Gardner and Mr. Hess will meet at the front of the school by the bus circle. Please do not go to the main gym. There is also a volleyball workout today after school until 5.15. Please be sure you have a ride here on time. Dragonfly must be 100% complete to stay for workout. Please see Coach Gardner during health and PE if you have any questions about your ability to stay for workouts. And now for this week's Positivity Project, Character Strength, Love. The character strength of love means that you value close relationships with others and being close to people. The character strength of love includes friendship. Today's challenge focuses on friendship. Take action and spread love to others today by telling a close friend how much their friendship has brought to your life. You can shut you can send them a text, write a note, make a card, or tell them face to face. Remember, a person can show love every single day. As you go through your day, be sure to look for opportunities where you can demonstrate the strength of love. And now for Shiloh with the lunch mix. Good morning, Northwest. So, I have a little lunch announcement. So, when you guys go through the line and after you put your number in, please say your name. Um, it's a new thing. And I understand if it's like hard, but tomorrow's breakfast will be um, griddled breakfast sandwiches or mini sinnies. And then today's lunch will be chicken alfredo or Wild Mike's cheese pocket on the main line. And then on the grab and go is Fiesta de Pizza. And now for Miss Richardson. All right, good morning, Northwest. I have an eighth grader as our Titan student spotlight. Let's give EJ a round of applause. All right, so EJ was recommended by Mr. Thomas. Uh, Mr. Thomas has some amazing things to say about you. So he said that he's a big fan of EJ. He said, EJ is, hard, is a hardworking student who does a great job in class. He helps his classmates. He works well in both group and by himself. He is also a sponsored dirt bike racer. How amazing is that? So first, tell us um, what team you're on in eighth grade. I'm on Helios. Helios team. What's your favorite subject? Uh, math. Math with Mr. Thomas, of course. All right. Um, what do you enjoy about school? Probably like the incentives and stuff. The incentives and things. Okay. Now tell us about this dirt bike, dirt bike racer. Tell us about that. Uh, it's really like every weekend or every every other weekend. Mhm. Mm and it's actually two of us in the school. Ryder, you know Ryder. What grade? Uh, seventh. Seventh grade. Yes, Ryder. Shout out to Ryder in seventh grade. It's me and him, and we got to race this weekend. Actually, got to race this weekend. So how long have you been racing dirt bikes? Uh, I've been riding since I was like four, but I've been racing for like three years now. Wow, okay. Is it something like, has to be something super exciting to do. Yeah, you yeah. just can't get hurt. Can't get hurt. That's the only thing that's not fun about it. Gotcha. So you've been riding a dirt bike since four years old. You've been racing for the last three years. Tell us about a memorable race. Uh, It was probably this one called Deer Haven. Mm -hmm. I got my concussion there. It was, it was That's real, memorable. It was real, like, muddy, and mm -hmm. I slid out and hit a tree. Oh, no. All right. How many victories have you had so far? Like, first place or, like, top five? Top five. Like, at least ten. At least ten. Wow. Amazing. Guys, let's give EJ another round of applause. Next week, I'm looking for a sixth grader for our Titan Student Spotlight. So, sixth graders, be on your best behaviors. I'll be coming through the sixth grade building. Also, maybe seeking out some teacher recommendations. As always, please remember to be respectful, be responsible, and be safe. Have an amazing day, Titans.